Taylor Lumpkin tells us why health officials say school districts are being reckless and are not doing enough to protect students. Positive COVID-19 cases are on the rise in Jefferson County and health officials say schools are the main reason why they're seeing this increase. And it is very important for us to control the spread of the virus. And that simply isn't happening right now as a direct result of schools. Sam Rose Giacvani, an epidemiologist for the Jefferson County Health Department, says COVID-19 cases in the area are climbing. And he says a direct result of these cases comes from school districts in the county not requiring masks to be worn for students or staff. The decision-making authority is in the hands of school boards of education who are really, truly recklessly ignoring public health guidance right now. The Fort Atkinson School District is expected to hold a board meeting tonight, a meeting where health officials and many parents are hoping stronger protocols will be put in place to mitigate the spread of COVID-19. Fort Atkinson School District is where we have our, our the highest number of outbreaks. They've had over 20 positive cases just this week alone, and many of those students were in school while contagious without masks, spreading into others in their classrooms. Giacvani warns that if mask mandates aren't enforced within Fort Atkinson and surrounding districts soon, positive COVID-19 cases will continue to skyrocket. They're choosing to ignore reality on the ground. They're choosing to ignore the state of the pandemic in Jefferson County right now. We did reach out to the Fort Atkinson Atkinson School Board President for a comment regarding the health department's claims, but have not heard back. Reporting in Fort Atkinson, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News.